Hello everybody, Cam S here. Today we are going to be going over and unboxing Big Game Tree Stands Pack and Pull Deer Cart. you can see its key features what it is designed for what the dimensions are and all that kind of stuff so if you want to pause it there go ahead and do so so you can see what all this product includes so let's get into the box when opening up the box is the first thing you see it is not as in as many pieces as I thought it was going to be. So hopefully it will be an easy process to put together. I will take everything out of the box and show you what all comes with it. So this is everything that comes with it. You get your instruction manual, a sticker, your main body assembly, a rod that goes somewhere in it, your washers and bolts and that kind of stuff, a strap, and then the main thing I noticed with these wheels is they're solid plastic, I think. They are very hard. And that was one thing I was worried about with this, that we have a lot of thorns that are like that long that go straight through your boot. So I figured they'd have no problem going straight through a tire. And I do not think that will be an issue with this. I was worried that the tires were going to pop, but I am not concerned about that anymore. So I will look at the instructions, figure out how to put this together, and I will show you how things go so this rod that you come that comes with it is the axle so you have to put it through this bar and the axle frame itself so you have to make sure it goes through both of these So it looks like you just take your spacer first, put that on there, put a washer on, and I will zoom in close on the other side so you guys can get a better look at what I'm doing, but I'm just explaining it right now. And then you put your wheel on. Then you put a, another washer on, and then your nut cap so as you can see right here this is the axle frame and then you need to put it through this bar on both sides as well and then you just put your spacer on one of your washers then your tire then a another washer and then your nut cap which I found that you do need a mallet or a hammer of some sort to put this cap on because it is very difficult to put on. And then you just take these leftover straps and clip one on over here to the front and you clip the other side back here. And then I will redo the camera and show you where I'm supposed to clip it on to back here. And then you clip the other end of this to the front like I did on the other side. And then it, you just clip it down. There's a little hole down here that you clip it into right there. So this is what the straps are on for that I just put on. And then you can take it off. Push a button right here to 
to extend the handle. So then you push another button right here and then pull up. Until it extends so I decided to bring it outside to show you the setup and how quick it is to pull apart and then put it back together And you're all set to go with that. And just for a weight comparison, it says it can hold up to 300 pounds. And then to collapse it, you just have to push these two in, push down, and then push these two in. Push down. and you're ready to go. So I obviously have not used it in the field yet, but so far I think it will work pretty good. I'm pretty excited to use this thing, even if it's just to take tree stands out, and then I think this will make it so much easier. And the setup is very easy. Straight out of the box, it is very easy just to put together. You don't have to use much time up to put it together you just need i think a hammer is pretty much all you really need to put this together you don't need any other tools or anything like that so that makes it a lot nicer i also think it is pretty easy to set up you can put it right over your shoulder take it out to the woods and when you get out to the deer you can just extend it the handle out and extend the basket out as well so I really do think it will be very useful out there. Hopefully you'll get to see me use it this season and hopefully it will be as helpful as I think it will be. So I hope this answered any of the questions you may have had of what comes with this product. I hope that I have helped you made some decisions on whether or not this is a good thing to get. So if you have any other questions that you'd like answered about this, Leave them in the comment section below. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, the like button, and turn the bell notification button on, please. So thank you for watching. I appreciate it a lot, and I will see you next time.